Welcome to drillingcontractor.org. This is Kelly Ainsworth reporting from the SPE Annual Technical Conference in San Antonio, Texas. Last month, Weatherford launched a new auto tong system. I'm here with Scott McIntyre, auto tong product champion, to learn more about this new technology. Thank you for joining us today, Scott. Thank you, it's my privilege. What are some of the inefficiencies associated with manual connection makeup that the auto tong eliminates, and how is this achieved? Well, when you look at casing running, casing running is an operation that requires you know, this same process to be done over and over and over again. So you've got literally got hundreds of connections in each of your casing strings. And as we have humans that are involved with that, you know, obviously people aren't going to be the same on joint 15 as they are going to be on joint 236. It's just, it's not going to be as consistent throughout the process. Where bringing automation to that process brings consistency and precision every single time we do the connections. So in addition to the connection makeup process with the Autoton, the auto evaluate is the other portion of the Autoton system that really gets rid of the human inefficiency. So rather than the humans looking at a graph and trying to interpret is the graph correct, is there you know, an anomaly in the graph, now the computer system and our auto evaluate software evaluates the data evaluates the connection makeup based on the data not just looking at the screen resolution which makes it much more accurate and much more precise and brings you the consistency of automation and speaking of the auto evaluate software how does that software help the driller detect and mitigate connection anomalies so the auto tong system in addition to auto evaluate you know make sure that we can mitigate and detect anomalies in a couple of different ways. So when you spin in a connection with a high speed, there's a reference torque that is set that the, the system will automatically stop when it reaches that reference torque. So the reason for that is twofold. The reason for that is if you're making up a connection and it, you have get a spike in the torque as you're spinning in, then you want the system to stop so you don't end up damaging that connection, especially important with CRA materials that are subject to galling tendencies. The other point of that is it stops and it gives you a set point and a consistent set point when you switch into low gear and now you're doing your final makeup that it's going to be the consistent start point for every single time when it does the connections. The other part what it does from a detection standpoint is let's say we do detect a non-conforming connection. Well what Auto Evaluate does is it then goes in and it will tell you, all right, here's what, you, here's what we found, here's what's the problem, and it shows you a different, um, here's what the root cause is, She's what the problems would be, and it identifies what you need to do to fix it. So it has real-time support as far as what you need to do to fix those connections. And what do you see as the next steps in the evolution of the Autotong system? That, that's a great question. So here at the, at the show, we have our Autotong for conventional operations. So this is still the hands-on. The you know, operator will operate the tong via the hand grip. But this is just the first step that we have with Autotong. So we are field trialing this product right now in Q4 in several different regions across the globe. But our engineering teams are also developing our fully mechanized system. So what that will be, that will be targeting our offshore locations, offshore um, operations, where it is a fully mechanized tong. We already have mechanized tongs, but we're bringing automation to those mechanized tongs. So the conventional tong that we have today does the final makeup is automated but what we're driving towards and what we'll be delivering in early 2018 is a fully mechanized automated tong that does the full makeup cycle it's not just the final makeup but as soon as you hit go it'll do the spin in it will do the change to low t low gear it will do the final makeup and the complete auto evaluation as well. So the entire thing will be hands-off operation, which helps from a safety standpoint, getting people off people off the uh, rig floors, and you know reducing our operators' cost as well. Well, thank you so much for joining us today, Scott, and telling us about this new technology. Thank you very much. Thank you. And thank you for joining us on drillingcontractor.org.